A fire at a factory in Naugatuck sent firefighters scrambling to knock out the flames. Officials say the multi-metal manufacturing company collapsed today after going up in smoke. News 8's Mark Robbins on the scene in Naugatuck with the story. When firefighters arrived after the first alarm shortly before 2 o'clock, they found the building engulfed in flames. And this low, wide design of the building made it difficult for them to attack those flames. The offices of Multimetal went up in a rush of fire and smoke. These reported pictures are proof. The glass surrounding the building blown out. I came out and looked over and seen all the building was in fire and all of a sudden all the windows blew out of it. It was loud. I've never seen nothing like it. Loud and huge. The scene so big, firefighters couldn't go inside. Naugatuck called on Waterbury for assistance. There's a big fuel load between the cubicles, the chairs, desks, computers. Uh, they had a lot of fuel to the fire, so it grows fast. Uh, we just had a large fire condition, unable to reach all of the fire from outside the building. We did have two ladder trucks operating, one of ours, one from Waterbury. We tried to get it from the top, but the roof had already caved in. This building has been a fixture near the Naugatuck Waterbury border for a long time. News of the fire shocked one man who lives across the street and whose stepfather works for the company. Well, the whole place was burned to the ground. I mean, you could see right through it, so. It didn't look too good. Was anyone hurt? I don't know if anyone was in it or whatnot. No civilians were hurt. A couple of firefighters suffered minor injuries. The neighborhood certainly awakened and shaken by this sight. I was all the way at the end. It was crackling, popping. There was a couple of pops inside from coming from inside the building. Due to the roof collapsing, it's going to make the cleanup here a lot more difficult and a lot more time-consuming. Firefighters expect to be here all day. On the scene in Naugatuck, I'm Mark Robbins, News 8.